Hearty people, we're back with Rival Stars Horse Racing, and today we're doing a very, 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 very special video on a very, very, very special horse. Yes, it's Golden Princess. Now, if you guys remember when I actually bred her, it was a very special day. She is probably the rarest thing I accidentally bred. If you guys didn't see that video, I'll leave it in the description below. Go and have a little snoop through that if you get five minutes. So yeah, guys... I love this mare, she's amazing, but we haven't really done much with her, so I thought, you know what, I'm going to do a whole video just on her. So let's talk about her a second. So her stats aren't the best, alright, okay, they're not, uh, but you know what, she's beautiful, so that's the main thing. So she's a thousand metre distant runner, she's got soft ground, and she's a middle pack preference, which normally, if you guys know, my favourite uh, pack preference is front. So you can see, I don't really know where this colouring came from. It was completely random. Um, I think it's probably from this one here, this almighty attempt. But yeah, she's bred some really nice foals as well. I'll just show you recently in the last of the lockdown foals breeding videos. I'll leave a link to those as well. We actually bred, I forget if it ever gets the end of the stable block. I believe this is her, this one here. We've just bred this one here. As you can see, guys, these all need names. So uh, jot down some ideas for us there. That'd be great. I'm, I've got a notepad. I'm writing all your suggestions down. Then we're going to do a whole video on naming naming these horses again. So, yeah, Golden Princess, um, this is her one of her daughters. And she's got exactly the same coat pattern, but she's kind of uh, obviously like a, a bay colour. Yeah, so awesome. If you guys want to see more of my uh, breeding videos, make sure you subscribe because we're going to have loads, not just with rival stars. I mean, I've got loads of horse games on the go. Wait, I mean, I am the Lady Ranger gamer. I mean, come on. <laughs> so guys, today all, is all about Golden Princess because she's absolutely super. Let's take some snazzy photos of her. We do actually need her to have a whole new outfit. So I tell you what, because we have the money at the moment, I'm going to go and splash out on her. I don't like the curious look. I think it looks a bit weird. That looks seriously cool. Let's save that. That makes me so happy. So happy. I like the uh, I like the galloping one. Uh, the fence in front doesn't look great. I like the ones with like the blossom trees in the background. I think they look really pretty. I think the colours really contrast. Where's that one? Like that one's cool. I like it. I just really like this mare. When I bred her, literally, I felt like I was having a heart attack. <laughs> Who's her mum and dad, actually? Let's check her pedigree out. Yeah, so actually, I said to you guys ages ago, oh, Candy's never really bred anything interesting. Oh, she made up for it. Oh, she made up for it. So we still have Candy, actually, in the block here, right next to her. So here we go. So we have three generations here, which is good. Yeah, so I absolutely love this game. So guys, let's go and find her whole new outfit. Let's go to customization and probably spend a silly amount of money on tack. So as you can see, we uh, we made Dakota a whole new outfit. Go and check that out. We had a whole video on this guy. He's one of our favorite stallions, isn't he? Specs had a whole new outfit. Here we go. Here we go. Now, as you guys said, we have uh, <laughs> the names matching on this little like black box here. So let's see what we get. Now, she's a kind of like very dark, like I'm going to call it the word tangy uh, palomino. So what colour is going to go well on a palomino? I don't want to, I kind of want to avoid the other, I want something different that we've not had yet. The rising star one's really nice, but we used that on Aria. I'll show you guys. Oop. Unequipped. So, oh, Sugar's really pretty, actually. Captain Jack's going to have his own video soon. So this is the Rising Star one that I used on Aria. And actually, I thought that looked pretty cool. Is there anybody else with a... I swear I... Yeah, here we go. Candy's gone all pink. I mean, she looks awesome in that, doesn't she? Which one's your favourite look, guys? I think that's the only one. Yeah, Silver Fox I also went nuts with and went all green, matchy sets. Hat Alligator's going to need one. But as I said to you guys, if you haven't seen the lockdown videos of uh, breeding the last lockdown foals, then go and check that out. I will leave them in the descriptions below. But you'll also see that we have done videos on customising our horses as well. Oh, and a quick. Let's just find Golden Princess again. Just uh, comment below which is your favourite horse out of that bunch. It'd be interesting to find out, actually. Because you all have different opinions. What about this white tack? That's called Hot Rod. Let's have a look. Let's see what Hot Rod looks like. I'm trying to find it all now. I've got to like match it up. Whereabouts was Hot Rod in the quite far on number ooh, about number seven ish? What's this one? That's Peachy Keen. Peachy Keen would actually probably look really nice on her. I don't think Red goes. 
What do you guys think? I don't think red really goes there. Hot rod. Okay, I'm going to have to work my way through it. One. One. Two. Three. Just want to find the matching stuff. I actually have matchy matchy sets. <laughs> I know, it's so sad. For my horse in real life. I got the Lemure. If you don't know what that is, go check it out. Just make sure you, <laughs> you're you bracing yourself for the beauty that is Lemure. And we have the matching set of... Oh, that's hot rod. It's the red one. Oh, no, I don't like that then. Oh, no, don't like that. Oh, I don't like it. So, yeah, I got my horse the matching peacock set. Yeah, I bought, like, the whole hat silk, cross country colours, boots, the lot. I know, it's mad. It's mad. But I love it. So I'm going to probably go a little bit crazy and get matching sets for all of our horses. If you guys haven't seen the face reveal, I'll also leave that in the description, actually. That'd be really cool. Do you guys like that one on her? That's actually quite nice. Tropical sunrise. She's kind of like a tropical sunrise, isn't she? When she's a golden princess. Let's look for that. Now that's quite far on in the in this here. So tropical sunrise. What's this one? Jade jewel. That's really hard to say actually. Tropical sunrise. There it is. Uh, do I like that? Let's, no, let's put the whole uh, shebang on her there. Let's just get it all matchy sets and then see see what it looks like. Is this a tropical? Yeah, that's an... How would you say this again? Azur. Azur? Oh, I kind of like that Jade Jewel on her, actually, as well. But I think we need, like, a darker colour for Jade Jewel. Tropical Sunrise. There it is. Mm, not sure now. Let's just check out what the bridal looks like. Tropical Sunrise. I'm not exactly worried about um, price, guys, because, let's face it, um. I'm minted. <laughs> Seriously though, like I can get the money back. Like whoop, I can get it back so quick. Ah, uh, where is this tropical sunrise thing gone? Tropical sunrise. Is this you? No, that's lemon tempo. Lemon. So do you guys have horses and do you do the whole like matchy set thing? Because yeah, my my parents call me like lame for doing that. But most of my friends do it. We all do it. Um, I don't know where that tropical paradise thing's gone. Tropical, what's it called? Sunrise. What's this one? Oh, I'm going to get annoyed in a minute. I haven't got very much patience, guys, when I can't find stuff. It annoys me. Cut. We've probably gone straight past it. I mean, let's face it. I mean, that was hot rod. It, uh, which one is it, guys? Oh, I'm going to cry. Did you comment below? Oh, there it is. Mm, what do you guys think? Do you think that would look alright on her? Do you think that looks alright? Or do you think it's not like standing out enough? Because it's it's pretty much it's pretty much the same colour as her. Oh, I'm not sure. Um, should we try another one? Let's go with the saddle pad. Normally gives us a good idea. I quite like this colour here, but I don't I think this needs to be, have a darker coloured horse really. Let's see what else we got. We've got this like weird burgundy thing. No, what do they what's that colour called? The, like Burbage or something. I can't remember what the colour's called. Yeah, you guys probably think I'm mad. I am. Right. Ooh, that one's quite nice. The porcelain silk. Pretty. I like the shapes of these numbers, these ones. Let's just see what the porcelain silk looks like with the saddle. Where's the porcelain silk? Let's have a look. Oh, there. Boom. No, I don't like that one. I don't like it. No, no, no. So I really like the Rising Star one. Guys, you know what? I might just... I don't know. I don't know what to do. The black's nice, but black isn't really her, is it? We need to make... Ooh. Ooh. Is that, is that quite nice, that one? Candy Club. We haven't had Candy Club yet for anybody, have we? Okay, let's check it out. Is this Candy Club? Where's Candy Club? Where is Candy... Oh, we did have Candy Club. That's the pink stuff that we put on Candy. Wasn't it? Wasn't it? What about Pioneer Blue? Is that just rubbish? I don't know what to do. What's mil... mil, mil I'm just going to pretend I know what that means. Right. Uh, Lavender Tempo is quite nice, but I don't think she's kind of like... What about Pastel Palace? That saddle's quite nice. Is this Pastel Palace? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe this could be something here, guys. Ooh. What are we going to go for? We need something pink. It's going to be pastel. Pastel, pastel, pastel. That looks like a pastel. That's a rose champagne. Oh, I want to check that one out now. This is the other one we were looking at, the porcelain, but I don't think the white looks that great. That maybe needs to go on a black horse or something darker, you know? 
Oh, here we go. Mm, no, don't like it. <laughs> okay, let's check out this one. What, what's that one called? Oh my goodness. Rose Champagne. Are you Rose Champagne? That looks like a Rose Champagne. Oh, I don't know whether I like the pink. I'm not a big fan of pink, guys. Like, I am I'm not. I, I really like... Isn't this the stuff we put on candy? I don't know. I can't remember. Let's go bridal. I'm just going to buy... I think I'm going to settle with this one. And... This looks like it, doesn't it? Rose champagne. Okay, do you know what? View cut. Let's buy it. Let's do it. Buy it all for one and a half million gold. Yeah, I'm more of like a blue turquoise type person. So now we've got Golden Princess's new outfits. Let's run her and see what she looks like, shall we? Hee <laughs> hee. We might be breeding a foal from her, guys, in today's video as well. Ooh, two million pound. Who's going to run that? Oh my goodness. Because we haven't actually tried... Look how... You look so cool, Aria. So this is how I make I make my money, guys. I enter my best horse with TJ's pick for those really crazy, 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 crazy high races. Let's just enter this random one in here. And then let's see if we can find... Actually, what is... Let's go back to the training block a second. If we can make Golden Princess look really cool today, that'd be wicked. Like, in terms of qualifications is that what you'd call it or awards that's probably more likely so look we've done max 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 <laughs> i think it's really cool i'd like to have them all maxed because i think that would just look really wicked oh uh, so captain jack is going to get his own video soon so subscribe don't miss out on that one guys it's gonna be wicked we're gonna do loads of breeding with him volcanic vol blah, 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 blah. volcanic candy i love him he's not going anywhere Golden Princess, let's go here. So, oh, we've got so much to do. So, if we just uh, go on Golden Princess and train so much that we can. Oh, this is so painful. Oh, my goodness. So, this is fun. I love clicking these buttons. They're great. So, yeah, guys, I've been trying out, uh, like, Star Stable and stuff like that. I did have a two-week trial. I'm pretty sure the two weeks are up, which is kind of telling me I don't think I'm going to get the game. I just don't know what it is. I like it, but it just it just feels a little bit... I don't know, it's lacking in something for me. And I think it's the genetic diversity thing. I mean, I know Rival Stars isn't like the most detailed, but actually one game that's really holding itself with me at the moment is Rival... Not Rival Stars, we're currently playing Rival Stars, is the Horse Reality. And also a new one that I'm going to post very soon. I probably already have posted it by this time. There's a new game called Equiverse, which is stunning. I know. I really want to make this channel a full-time job, guys, because I'm having so much fun, and I just cannot get over how lovely you guys are. Like, all the comments I've had, everything, has just been absolutely out of this world. So I really want to give back to you guys and just make more content. I want to start that uh, real-life vlogging channel with our four horses, Misty, Lily, Georgie, and... Blackjack. If you haven't seen the face reveal, as I said earlier, I'll leave it in the description below. But you know what? It's just so, like, I don't know, it's so exciting. It's really brought life back, and especially through this rubbish time of lockdown. I mean, what's kept you sane through lockdown? For me, it's it's starting this channel, actually. I mean, my job's great. I'm really lucky. Like, I've been able to work through lockdown, um, and I just feel like I was getting a little bit sort of kind of down in the dumps a little bit about everything I was sort of fed up you know we can't do anything I thought do you know what I'm just gonna start this channel and see what happens and it's I just I just can't believe luck really I cannot believe luck so um I cannot thank you guys enough for all the support and everything so far but hopefully we're gonna have membership options soon and then I can bring you guys even more content and hopefully I can start maybe backing down I work I work quite a few jobs actually I work two jobs I know, mad. Uh, <laughs> it's crazy. I, I work many, many jobs. So, yeah. So then I, I just want to do this. This is like the best. And you guys are just the best, basically. You're all awesome. That's what you all are. So, yeah. I think it's all good. So, you guys playing any games because you've been watching the channel? Is there anything that's inspired you? I know a lot of you guys have been playing Wild Horses Valley as well as this. 
uh, the rival stars and I know lots of you who were playing the mobile version have actually decided to invest in the desktop version because you can see how much <clears throat> easier it is so um, are you finding it okay have you bought the desktop version I know it's 35 pounds 40 dollars equivalent I think is that right so oh gosh how many hours have I spent on this game hmm so even if I spent like yeah like loads of loads of hours it's gonna be worth the money guys it really is okay so we've just trained golden princess up to level 20 that's the most we can do at the moment through what she's raced through through with what she's raced how do i even say that so let's go find something that's kind of like about the level 20-ish or maybe even under yeah something like this um yeah maybe this one here actually because it's got good money Let's see if we can find it. It'll probably like suggest all horses, but Golden Princess. At least you guys get to see through all my uh, really cool horses right now. Which one's your favourite? Which one's your favourite one? Fussy Foghorn needs a new name because I hate that name. Spex is the original. Ari is stunning, isn't she? I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> she's awesome. Um, this is actually Golden Princess's daughter. Why is Golden Princess never come up? Captain Jack is there. Sarcastic badminton. Where's Golden Princess? Have I just come past her? Am I being really stupid? Probably. I mean, it's highly likely. Black Rose, these are all my horses. There we go. Yeah, I'm happy with that. I think she looks quite cool in that pink, actually. Cool, let's go for it. Is she capped? No. Haha, -ha, let's put a big, chunky bet on there, then. Cool, we're going to get... Because the, the odds are quite, like... I don't know, they're good, aren't they, for your money? Look how much we'd get if we win. If we win. So guys, do you know what we're going to do? I'm not going to run it. We're going to watch it. Because it looks so cool. And this is actually a really cool aspect of the game I like. Is being able to watch. Because imagine if you had to run it all yourself. I think you'd lose the plot. I did that actually on the first <laughs> first time I ever played it. Before I even started this channel. I completed the Rival Stars game. And I stupidly never hired jockeys or put bets on. So it took me like double the amount of time to do anything. I wanted to cry, honestly. I wanted to cry. Excitement building here at Bill and Court. How beautiful is this Bill and Court, by the, the way? The graphics on this game are wonderful. We just need a brand new horse tycoon game. Like this, but not on, on racing. We need it on horses. Like breeding, different events, blah blah blah. Wait, which number are we? Where is she? Golden Princess! The oh, there she is. Aww. Wow, there's a lot of spotted horses in this run. What do you guys reckon? Yeah, our name was totally, totally announced there. So there's another cool aspect of the game as well, like your horse's name if it's commentary compatible or whatever commentary friendly there's the word there's the word yeah they call your name out i think it's wicked i kind of like the look of this gray horse next to golden princess i feel like uh, i don't feel like we're doing very well guys whoops we didn't do very well we came second oh well we just golden lost like loads of money on that. Well place. done, Golden Princess. <laughs> At least we saw her run. That was cool. So guys, we're just gonna. Um... Oh, I don't know whether to breed her actually because because we have our stable block full and oh my gosh, and I don't know what to do. I do like this horse, but I might sell her if we get a cool looking fox. Should we just breed? Should we just breed Golden Princess and see what we get? I think this will be wicked. Let's do it. Breed horse. Hosse. Hosse, hosse, hosse. So what's the most interesting uh, colour you've managed to breed so far? Oh my gosh. Vol Volcanic Candy is actually gorgeous. Let's go with Golden Princess. I might use a random stallion, actually. But we run the risk of having a level 9 horse. That's the only problem. Ooh, okay, do you know what? I'm gonna use my stud. I'm gonna I'm gonna use my stud. I'm too scared. Okay. Let's go for it. Let's just see what happens. Let's quick buy. We've got 37 million still in the bank, so we're alright. Oh, this is gonna be painful. You guys ready? We're gonna skip for a million pounds. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, oh no. Please don't be a filly. 
That was a cult. Oh, I really like him. I really like him. I like him. But, big but, um, he's, I don't like him as much as the other one I've read. Oh, now this, this is a ripe palaver that we have here. Oh, no. I kind of feel like I want to sell River, but she's got those cool uh, dapples that I don't want to get rid of yet, you know? Ooh, some of you guys reckon I should sell Rain and stuff. I was like, what? Let's sell Sarcastic Bad... Ooh, no, let's sell Sugar, actually, guys. Just because I feel like we could definitely... We can definitely breed sugar again, I reckon. If we breed rain a bit more, I reckon we'll get this this colour through. So let's have a look here. Do, 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 do. He's so cute. If he was a filly, I might have kept him. Let's see what he looks like as a stallion there, guys. This is wicked. Parsnips Pocket. What a silly name. What a silly name. Let's see what he looks like. Yeah, he's really nice. He is really nice. He's not as nice as my other one. Um, because I don't like this, like, dirty, like, look, weird colour there. But do you know what? Let's just sell him now before the heartbreak continues. I want more fillies. I keep breeding my stallions at the moment. Sell. Sorry, Bernie. You're lovely. You're really cool. But I want something really unique and different. Ah, oh, so guys, this means we have an empty horse stool. This could be very dangerous. <gasps> Tell you what, I'm going to leave that empty horse stool for our next video, which is going to be all about Captain Jack. Captain Jack's going to have a whole video to himself, and of course, he's a stallion, so what we're going to be doing, we're going to be using him as a stud and seeing what foals we get. Hee <laughs> hee, it's going to be awesome. I can't wait. What should I say? Awesome. Ah, okay guys, do you know what? I feel like Golden Princess is one of the most beautiful ponies I've actually ever bred. And I've been so lucky with her as well. So, yeah, guys, thank you for watching. This was all about Golden Princess. We got a foal, we did a race, we gave her a new outfit. I feel like we did a lot. We did a lot just then. So, guys, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. I just, yeah. We've got so much horse content on the way, guys. It's going nuts. Oh, dear. Have a awesome day, and I'll see you very soon. Bye!